The braces on five-year-old Vivian Collins' legs don't seem to slow her down one bit. Her contagious enthusiasm hides all signs of what she's already been through. When she was just two years old, intense pain led to a frightening and life-altering discovery. There was, it was two tumors and a cyst that had grown together inside her spinal column. It was as big as an adult's thumb. It was a very intense surgery. They did get all of the tumor. The cyst is what kept it benign, which is wonderful. <laughs> uh, she's had six surgeries in the past three years, and we're looking at another major surgery coming up probably this summer. That surgery will correct a hip problem, but other surgeries may be needed to correct other complications that may arise as Vivian grows. The tumor itself did a lot of damage. You have to move a lot of stuff around when you have to open the spine to begin with. And it's stuff, you know, you don't really expect it, but you expect problems when you have to do things like that. For Donna and her husband, Michael, Vivian's prognosis is unclear. Growth spurts can cause bladder or bowel problems or increase or decrease her mobility. For now, the Collins family and Vivian's six specialists are taking a wait-and-see approach. But no matter the challenge, Vivian continues to inspire. She has good days and bad days. Today is a good day and she's all over the place. There are also days that she cannot get out of bed because she's in that much pain. So, but today is good days and as long as we have more good than bad, we're happy. She is very humbling. She has such a positive attitude and such a great spirit. And there are times when I just, I just want to break down and stop for a little bit and she keeps me going. On this day, Vivian and her family returned to the Blairy Batson Hospital for Children, but not for treatment. They were there for the Mississippi Miracles Radiothon to encourage Mississippians to donate and support the state's only children's hospital. The Radiothon, an annual effort by Jackson Radio Station's Mix 98.7, US 96.3, and Y101, and several other radio people-owned stations in the Meridian area, has raised more than $2 million for the Batson Hospital since it began in 2001. We love being able to give back to our listeners. I mean, the people who come here are our listeners, you know. So it's kind of like one big family, you know. We, um, we just want to make sure that the kids here in Mississippi have the best possible chance for recovery, whether it be a broken bone or cancer. You know, that's why we're here. We want to make a difference.